Hey guys, what is up? Shadow Gamer here today. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use, install, and just like have fun with the Creative Gates plugin. So as you can see, I have two beautiful portals set up right here. And for those of you who don't know what this plugin is or what I'm talking about at all, it's basically like multiverse, which is what lots of people use. It's simpler though, and you don't actually even need a command like slash. I don't know, slash something. So yeah. Um, other than that, as you can see, we are on a server. And yeah, so I'll just show you guys what you're going to need. But before we do this, make sure you do not have this plugin in your plugins file. Like, in your server file, in your plugins folder, do not have this a massive core okay it will screw it all up but you're gonna download this and you can see it's version 2.7.5 so make sure creative gates is 2.7.5 or whatever version you want it to be and if you guys do want factions plugin for whatever reason it's made by the same developers and same version so why not all right and just for all you view spygot, spigot, whatever that is called, users, bucket does work with spygot, spigot. Like all bucket plugins should function properly on a spigot, spygot, whatever server. Just to make sure. So I'll put these links in the description. Enjoy. All right. So I'm gonna prove to you that this works right now. Okay. So you see, we came out the other side. And this, notice how this emerald is here and this emerald is here. You do need two emeralds somewhere in the frame to make the portal work properly, as you can see. But the emeralds can be anywhere, and it can be any shape as long as it's a full shape. So that helps quite a bit. <coughs> Alright, so let's go slash warp to you two. Alright, we are now here. Let's build our portals. So what you're going to need for one portal is this, this, and this. Okay. Congrats for him. So of course we're not in survival, so my blocks aren't counting down. I don't, I, I'm just dumb, guys. Okay. So we're going to build it like that, and then do this. So that's our standard portal. So for this, like, standard-sized portal, you're going to need two clocks, 24 stone, and four emerald blocks. Okay, you guys ready? So we're done with this, and we're done with this, unless I stupidly destroy it somehow. So now all we need is we need to use these clocks, we need to put two in, and name it whatever you want. It does not matter at all. And then, you ready for this? Click. And click. And just make note that wherever you are standing when you click is where the person will come out of the portal. So perhaps I should redo that because I was standing in basically the same spot. Let's just try that again. Yeah, let's do YoTube. Why not? And to destroy the portal, you just punch it. So obviously, world guard that. If you don't want it destroyed every single time someone left mouse click buttons it. Anyways, let's do this. So stand here, press, stand here, press. You ready for this? Oh, 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 strat. Alright, let's do it again. So as you can see, it's a really, really, really simple plugin. You can make, if you don't like the portals, this is a texture pack by the way though, so it looks different. But if you don't like the portals and you would rather have water and you don't want all these particles and the weird sounds and all that, you can make it water. You just go into the config file and change that. It's not very hard to do. Other than that guys, that's about it. I just have one more thing to talk about. Super duper 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 fast. Alright, so. You see? This clock right here, right here, right here. Okay, guys, in the bottom right of my screen, it says 
10.45 a.m. Other than that, it says 2015, July 9th, all right? So I hope most of you guys know how to add six to nine. <laughs> Anyways, so add six plus nine, okay, that equals 15, okay? Six days from now, today's the ninth. Six days from now is the 15th, July 15th, all right? So on July 15th, something's going to happen, and that something is going to be this place is going to be accessible to you guys, all right? So tell your friends that you guys want to play factions with them, because basically we'll let you guys do whatever you want on this, basically. You, well, to an extent. Um, we do need beta testers. We're doing, like, PB and League public beta environment, all right? So we're going to be publicly testing the server. And everyone who participates will get some kind of prize for when the actual server is released. So please participate if you want prizes. Yum, yum, yum. Other than that, I'll be, like, advertising the server like crazy until the 15th. And then I'll cry every TM if no one comes. So if someone come, you'll make cows cry. Don't make cows cry. You know what? Do you know who you will make cry? You ready for this? If you don't come on our server, this is who's gonna cry. This is who will cry. He will. Jeremy the cow. Don't make him cry, guys. Look at him. Look at him. Don't make him cry. He's so lonely. Be his friend. In other news, I forget what I was gonna say. Enjoy this blooper! So, this is a very easy to use plugin. It doesn't actually even use any commands like slash doo doo doo. I know. Okay, server. Okay, I know it's an unknown command. Oops. Well, let's go away now. <laughs>